everybody. My name is Tiffany Kiefer and I am the spiritual minister for UCM. And here we have the amazing, amazing Rachel Cooley today. Yay! Yay! She's a very, very dear friend of mine. She is not only the founder of Divine Guidance and an angel practitioner, but she is also the founder of the Angelic Guidance Mentor Certification Program that all of you can be part of. I am super, super excited to have you today. Rachel, you and I have been um, friends for several years now. We've grown so much together in both of our businesses. And actually, you trained me um, to be an angel mentor for a couple years, and I am extremely grateful for you. But um, today, we are actually going to be talking about your seven steps um, and how people can work with the angels. So Without further ado, I am super excited to have Rachel Cooley with you with us today. Welcome. Oh. Yay. Yay. Thank you, Tiffany. Thank you so much. So appreciate you interviewing me today, sister. It's a yes, joy to be yes. here with you, sharing about the angels and all the incredible blessings that they bring to us. Yes. I just want to um, share this to somewhere. I'm going to try. Oh, yes. <laughs> yes. Tiffany is going to do a quick share to her group as well. Right now, we happen to be streaming onto my page and then we're, she's going to be streaming onto hers as well, Attitude of Gratitude. So yes. we're grateful to be here live. There if you're joining us live, dear ones, as um, Tiffany's doing that, say hello in the comments so we know that you're here. Yes, please do. Let us know that you're here. And um, Rachel, thank you again for letting me interview you. And I'm super I'm super excited to know about your journey. Not everybody uh, knows who you are and knows what you do, but I know that you're my angel certification master. But, you know, all of us have a time and space in our lives where we decide that being the light is important and being the light is our journey. Can you kind of explain to us how... 25 years ago, you decided to be the shining light for everybody. Oh, thank you. Oh my goodness. Yes. Um, yeah, it's, I mean, it's officially is I'm in my 25th year and it's 25 years officially this September, Tiffany. It's been an incredible journey that I've been on with the angels. And it was just so fascinating how it all worked. It was like my, my mom introduced me to spirituality in my late teens, early twenties. And, um, the things that she taught me really helped me a lot. And so I kept going because I was like, this is really cool. I really like this because it was a different take than religion. It was like the spiritual path goes in so many beautiful directions, right? Yeah. For yeah. our highest good. And I just went on that path. And then my mom took me to lots of spiritual talks. I went to spiritual talks. And then I started receiving angelic gifts from my friends, my spiritual friends I was meeting, angel books, angel statues. That's the precursor. And then that led me even more on the path um, to towards the angels, especially after an experience that I had where um, I really feel and know that my angel saved my life when I was with my mom. I'm uh -huh. driving in a car when the road turned icy. I was guided what to do by my angel's voice. And wow. that was a huge wake up. Yeah, that was an amazing experience that happened in 98, driving, wow. on, driving on a, um, a road that turned icy and I was guided what to do. And so this, this is a precursor to me really the next year going on the path of the angels, it was like, I knew I needed to take this path, especially when I heard about a particular angel book that really resonated with me. And then the doors just kept opening, Tiffany. I got the book from our local spiritual bookstore. Then I found out she was coming to town. And then I went to hear her speak. And then I had her sign my book. And then I went back to, um, to go to lunch. And then my angels guided me to go back to talk to her. So I'm speeding up a few wow. years. Yeah, yeah. But but basically the angels were really present with me and then I knew I needed to go down this path. And the first thing that I really wanted to help with with them is to receive relief from intense fear, stress, and worries. Because oh. I grew up in that energy. And they know? do that? They do that. Yes, they do. That is one of their fortes that I love that the angels help us with. They are amazing at helping to reassure us, to help us to literally take from us with our permission, our fear, stress, and worries. And that is a miracle right there. 
each time Absolutely. that happens, right? Absolutely. Yes. So, Asking our angels is, I mean, like you, like you always tell us, we need to ask. We need to ask. We need to ask exactly because the angels, the messengers of God really respect our um, free will choices and they need our open permission. Yes, please help me, you know, help me, you know, whether it's general or specific to a situation or what's happening for you, or please take the spear from me. They come through every time, every time. And yeah. then through us receiving relief from fear, stress, and worries, going back to what you were saying about shining your light, shining our lights, then we can shine our lights more brightly, Tiffany, and be more on purpose when we're relieved from our fear, stress, and worries, and we can really be present in the moment and be of service. Yes, I um, I really feel that the angels have guided me as well, especially once I learned from you how to ask. I learned from you everything that the archangels could help me with and in not only just relieving fear and taking it away from me, but also spiritual ties and anchors and and um, I, I asked Archangel Michael all the time, even today, even today, I was at the store and my little card reader wasn't working. And I said, OK, Archangel Michael, please help me with this technology. <laughs> and uh, he came through. No, I mean, he always comes through. All he the always angels, comes always through. Comes Isn't through. it awesome? Yes. It's so and, good. Michael's amazing. That's one of oh, his yes. first things. It's not only releasing us from fears, but also technology. It, right. And that's technology is huge nowadays. It is huge, right? It's amazing. Yeah, especially now with AI and everything, we really need some angelic, powerful, spiritual guidance there. Guidance and protection. <laughs> right. So I know that you have this masterclass coming up, but before we get into that, um, you focus a lot on helping other beings, helping uh, women. How, how, like, I know what difference you made in my life, which was you changed the trajectory of my life on how I word things, how I say things, how I think of things, how I heal things uh, with the angels. But, but that was my experience. I know that you've helped thousands of women, uh, probably you know, tens of thousands of women with your angelic journey and your therapies. Um, but can you give us some tidbits on how you support women with the angels? Absolutely. Absolutely. Um, I feel that there's, there's for specific areas that I really help women with, with the angels. One is, as I was sharing from my own experience, because a lot of women want relief from fear, stress, and worries, right? Whether it's regarding their relationships or health, or finances, mm -hmm. or maybe a move, you know, you had a move a couple years ago, yeah. um, or a career change, or a shift in a relationship. They're wanting relief from life stress, fear, stress, and worries. Also, um, a number of women are wanting support, you know, with, for, you know, more in depth with healing, with health, with being more, you know, tuned into their beautiful, vibrant health. And that, that is our, one of our divine gifts from the divine, from God. Mm -hmm. And also life purpose. A lot of women also are wanting support with their life purpose and also being more on purpose with what they're guided to do, you know, and it also could be that they're being guided to adding in the angels into what they're doing and what that that's where that my certification program comes in. Um, but it's, it's beautiful. And the women that come together in particular for my particular, my program that's currently happening, it's the, um, and we're starting up actually next month, but it's the angelic sanctuary journey. They're wanting to come together with other women also on the path of spirituality with the angels to come together in our sisterhood on a regular ongoing basis, because it becomes a way of life. It becomes a way of living to really get connected to the angels and to feel their presence and their blessings as I guide them all through angelic healing and clearing experiences that you've been through many times with me as well to help them feel more grounded, supported, and on purpose in their lives. You know, and I think people are really lacking a purpose right now. I they really you. want a purpose. They really want to know where what they're supposed to do what you know why am i here yeah and when we went through your certification program it was really eye opening to see the gifts and the downloads and the messages and all that come through um just when we open up 
and when we trust and when we're, you put us in such a safe place to share, to cry, to laugh, to, to expand and to know that we're really not crazy. Absolutely. You're not to normalize, to normalize ourselves. Right. Yeah. Right. Exactly. Exactly. It's like, wow, I really was getting a message from Archangel Michael. Like I kept getting those repetitive signs for a reason. Right. And so, and if you've noticed, there's a huge shift right now. Everybody sees signs. Everybody's like, I mean, all my, even my daughter now goes, mom, it's one, 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 mom, it's three, 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 you know, and she'll text me and, and say, see, I'm thinking of you, you know, or make oh, a wish. And I love, it. I love it. It's a huge expansion right now. Um, yes. I think people are, I don't like the word awakening. I, I, I think that we've always been awake. Yes. Um, I think that it's, um, it's a way for us to honor what we always have been. Yes. So and, that Tiffany. And, and to allow, allow it to be okay. Allow it to be normal. You know, I almost want to get um, emotional because when, when the whole transition started to happen, when I started to feel things and see things. And, and that was almost like when I met you, you know, everything happens for a reason. There are no coincidences, right? Exactly. Totally and timing. And for the journey that you took, took me through at several of us, that class, that's right. And, and being able to, uh, um, ignite the the downloads understand them be able to talk about them in a safe place you really provided a safe place for us to expand and for us to know and for us to hear and see and feel and i i can't recommend you enough uh rachel i can't thank you enough i'm immersed gratitude uh with you but i hope that everybody taps into your sisterhood, just even for your daily um, insights, um, if they're not ready to expand, right? Right. Um, but I, I really feel that we are expanding. We are, we are, we we are. are whether we like it or not, right? I mean, Look at, look well at said. how the new moon and all the astrology is coming out. I mean, all stuff that I don't quite understand. I just feel it, right? Yeah, you, we're feeling it big time. Like the energies are so intense, especially with the recent solar activity. Those, you know, that oh, yeah. that happened, right? In the Northern and exactly. all that. It was just crazy. So besides fear, worry, stress, um, what other normal day things can the angels help us with they can help us with finding what we're looking for they can help us with that 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 could be even anything from your keys to like like your life purpose to a job to a home to whatever that is you're searching for that and that beautiful healing practitioner that you're searching for or even a physician they can help us to find what we're looking for they help us with these things so beautifully. And really there's nothing they can't help us with, Tiffany. Anything from small to finding your keys that, that at the time was not so small, uh -huh. all the way up to big things like your life purpose, finding your soulmate, moving to your right and perfect new home, purchasing your right and perfect new home, which you were on that journey within the last couple of years. Right, you right. Know, there's so many ways they can help us. It's incredible. And I How just do we that. ask? How do we ask? We literally need to ask. And that can even literally be angels. If you're there, can you help me? That'll work. Just as simple as that. It could even be like that. Or it could be like, you know, anything from like, I'm not totally sure this works. I'm going to try it out to thank you angels for being with me now. I am so grateful for your presence. Thank you for protecting me and my home. Thank you for preceding me as I drive to the store right now. I am grateful keeping me safe and protected. Thank you so much. Like that, those are examples. I think it, it's, um, I've even used the protection myself and it's like one, when I feel unsafe, like I, I was in New York and I was on a road and, uh, and I felt unsafe and I just stopped and I said, Archangel Michael, please, 
your royal blue and purple light please surround Megan and I because I feel unsafe. Just make sure that we're protected. And it was like this wash over us. Like I knew that we were totally protected, that I could walk through there with confidence. And it almost gave me a little spring in my step because I yes. I knew that I was protected, you know? Isn't that amazing? Isn't that amazing? And that reminds me, Tiffany, of that quote I love from A Course in Miracles. If you only knew who walked beside you, fear would be impossible. Oh, can you say that one more time? That was if amazing. You only, if you only knew who walked beside you, who walks beside you, fear would be impossible. Ah. Oh. Just I think take you that need in. Breathe into one. that one. Breathe into that one. It's incredible. It's just like, wow, I have my guardian angel surrounding me right now. Archangel yeah. Michael's with me and he can be with me because he can be everywhere simultaneously. He can be with me 24-7. Yeah. I am safe all as well. And then, like you said, it brings a spring into your step. Yeah. You know, it helps you to feel more confident and then you can radiate your light even more. Yeah. It's amazing. And I'm super excited, Tiffany, if I think that if it's good for you, a good segue, I'm super excited because this is one of the things I'm going to be empowering women with, um, and, um, this Friday, I'm actually doing a masterclass called the seven steps to live a miraculous life with the angels, um, to wow. receive these blessings, to learn what these seven steps are to live with them in harmony, to help connect you with your divine birthright blessings. We're going to be doing a powerful activation. It's going to be amazing. Oh, and I can't is, uh, wait. It's going to be, okay. how do they, how do they sign up? Um, I'm going to put the link in the comments here okay. um, but, and we're, we're, we're streaming in a couple places. And then also this will be on the podcast, right? Yep. Mm -hmm. So um, for the universal church of the masters. So you'll have that there too. And also ways for them, um, you know, and more evergreen links for them to be connected with me. Um, but Wonderful. yeah, I'm going to pop the link in the comments. Join us amazing women for this, a powerful experience to come together with amazing like-minded women with the angels to tap into these seven steps and have this amazing, powerful activation. Oh, amazing. I'm so excited for Friday. What time is it at? Noon Pacific. Noon okay. Pacific on the 17th of May. So we're super excited about it. And um, yeah, Tiffany's going to be there. Of course, I'll be there because I'm leading. Yeah. And so many women are are registering and joining from all over the US. And I'm we'll most likely have um, actually one of the women who's registered so far is in Canada. So we're going to be an international audience. So you're global. I'm global already. Exactly. Exactly. So Super well, exciting, Tiffany. Oh my gosh. I am, I am so grateful that you shared this time and space with us. I'm so grateful that you're my mentor and I get to tap into you all the time. Uh, I hope that the other ladies that get to tap in uh, know uh, the safety that you bring, the protection that you bring, but most importantly, the guidance that you bring. And I hope that all of you join us on Friday at noon Pacific and um, with that, I'm going to go ahead and close. So close up. have yes, a wonderful day again, Rachel. So, so, so grateful for you. Oh, thank you so much, Tiffany. I am so, so, so grateful for you. And we'll stop our streams now. Angel blessings, dear ones. Have a blessed and beautiful day. Know that God and your angels are by your side and all is well. Take care, loves and angel blessings. We're going to stop our streams in a couple places all at once. Mwah. Bye for now and angel blessings.